Well, Kenny Smith is being treated for frostbite here inside Columbia St. Mary's Hospital behind me in their burn unit. He's known in Hubertus by his friends as Cowboy Kenny. Six horses. We got Chip right here and then behind him, behind the panel is Joel, Bogey and Tex, Henry and Dusty over there on the right side. A team of volunteers now caring for all of them. After their owner, Kenny Smith, fell in the snow while feeding them last week. The panel was half open and the horses were nudging at him, waiting for their green. Smith's longtime friend Brian Rosine had been calling all day and decided to check on the 75 year old diabetic when he found Smith lying in the snow, his dog barking, and Smith frozen, barely alive. That's where he sat from, I, I would say, six to eight hours. And I think in that time, he just struggled too much. A photo shows Smith now in the hospital. He almost lost all his fingers from frostbite and will need extensive rehabilitation. His horses used to work with Milwaukee County Sheriff's Mounted Patrol Unit, at city parades, the beaches, even Harley Davidson's 100th anniversary. Come on, Chip. It costs $200 a week to feed them and it's a full-time job. Smith's friends have helped raise over $2,000 on a GoFundMe. Support coming in from all over. People he doesn't know, people he does know, people he's, he's met in passing. All to help a man get back to his farm and his horses. So many people helping out. Caroline, you mentioned the fundraiser. Is there anything else that people can do to help? Yeah, Patrick, people can also volunteer their time. There's a need to help care for Smith's horses. We've got all that information on our website at WYSN.com. Caroline Reinwald reporting live in Milwaukee tonight.